How was your friend? She's fine, although she loves the baby due to stress. I know how much you were all looking forward to being a big girl. Yes, I was, but to some extent, I'm glad it happened the way it did. Alright, if you say so, please extend my greetings. I hope to meet her someday. I am Marcos. Please have a seat, Marcos. How can I be of help? I just came to say hello to you and ask if I could take you out for dinner or lunch later or any day of your choice. Just like that? You don't even know me. I'm just trying to get to know you. That's why I'm asking you out. Anyways, Mr. Marcos, I am busy and I'm not sure I'm free. Please, or I'll have to pay for your time. Excuse me? I know you are a busy woman and I won't deny that I love that about you. How about I become a client this afternoon? I'll pay the consultation fee to see you. I know you can do that, but you don't have to. I'll see you another time. I'll call you. Alright, Lucy. I'll expect your call. Enjoy the rest of the day. Easy, Ryan. Halima, so good to see you. Where are you coming from? And what is that you are holding? I went to the market to get some things. Easy, you started going to the market. When? How? Halima, the story of my life is something else. I can't even tell you all about it in a day. What about your, your mom? Your dad? My mom is late. And my dad? Hmm. He's just there. Why not let's get somewhere we can sit and talk better? I thought you left for this state already. I can't. I have to be home on time. If not, I will suffer a beating and they won't give my dad food. I'm confused here. I don't understand what you mean. <laughs> Life is a mess. Not even the hazard you know anymore. Stop crying. Just give me your number. I will call you later. Then we will talk. I don't have a phone anymore. Everything was taken from me. I will come over to see you. I think I still remember your house. Okay, I'll be expecting you. What would have happened to her? She is not the lazy that I know. Look at how she's looking. So I kept her ugly. You are back home. You said you would be back later in the night. I couldn't go where I wanted anymore. Why? There were some cars watching the house, mom. As I was standing, a car drove past me asking about you. Why would they ask about me? I don't know, mom. But I told them nothing. But one of the men in the car looked so scary, mom. What did he look like? Mom, I don't know how to describe his face. All I know is he gave me a very odd vibe and that's why I decided to come back home. Could that be Swanky? What is he doing here? Mom, isn't that the man you said you owe? Yes, he is. And if I don't settle him, they are going to take you and kill me. I don't even know. Why don't you just hand Azel over to them? Don't worry, it's almost time. She's coming of age already. We are just going to take everything from her and we are free. Mom, how could you deal with someone like that in the first place? If Swanky is here, then it means trouble. He's tired of waiting. I have to think of what to do very fast. I'm talking to you and you're not saying anything. Don't worry, I will handle everything. Just put your mind at rest, okay? How are you feeling? Much better. How was your day? Great. I met a young hardworking staff member at my workplace. Good for him because if one is not hardworking in these times, he's going to go hungry. True. But what he told me is something I have been thinking about over and over again. I know. You started giving him advice like a big auntie. You forgot that you are not old. I don't know why you do that. That's what makes me me. Anyways, this guy is in love with a woman who doesn't care nor see his value. Yes, we all seek a man who will love and care for us this way. Seriously, and he still chooses to stay with her. He loves her, that's why he stayed back. Same way we all stayed back even though we know the man does not love us. I've made up my mind about what I'm going to do. Which is? I plan on living and settling somewhere else. I might get lucky there. You plan on leaving us and going somewhere new? Jordan doesn't know what he's doing. How does he expect that I use this to take care of myself? What does he want me to buy out of this? Jordan, why did you drop this here? What do you want me to do with it? It's the little I have. We don't need to start this conversation again. You are telling me that what I have isn't enough. You should at least appreciate that I'm doing something. You can't keep living like this, Jordan. Soon, you will have to have an apartment of your own. 
Are you driving me out of your house now? I will soon. How can you be staying in the house of the woman you're dating? And my friends are coming over. I only know one of your friends, Lucy. How did they become so many? Whatever. I'm going to bed. And you're not sleeping here. You should better go to sleep in the living room. How do you expect that I go sleep in the living room? And that aside, what about us, baby? That's the only thing you know and are so good at. So you are going to say that you don't feel the same way for me anymore, Zoe? Whatever. I'm tired. I'm going to bed. I know you love me so much. And I love you too. I'm serious when I say you should get your apartment. I can't keep feeding a grown man. Thanks for meeting me. You were ready to pay for my time. I'm sure if I don't agree to this, you're going to pay the whole staff and the auto just for them to get busy. I am a man who knows what I want. I will do anything to get it. So what do you want, Marcus? To make you my woman. Lucy, right from the very first day, I set my eyes on you. I knew you were the one. I'm too smart for all those words. I won't be surprised if you don't. Okay, it's a good thing that you know that. Looks like you've been through lots of heartbreaks, so you don't trust any man. Not really. I had an accident in school, but that was when I was foolish and not thinking well. Just say yes to me then. I'm just getting to know you. I can't just jump at you like that. It's okay. I don't mind walking through the process of making you trust me if that's what is going to let you trust me. Okay then, the gentleman. Yes, I won't pressure a lady into my will, so let's place our order. I love you here. I'm so calm and beautiful, but there's no one here. That's because I wanted to be alone with you here tonight. Are you saying that you paid for it all? Yes, if it means spending time with the woman I care about, then yes, I just wanted to spend the night alone with you without hearing other voices other than just yours. Wow, I'm sure the voice to say to you, but thank you. I appreciate it. It's nothing. I just want the lady to say yes to me. Hey, Izzy, since the last time I saw you, I have been worried. Halima, I don't know what I'm going to do. What happened? Grace? My dad's mistress came back to the house and then things turned to what I don't know. What about your dad? What is he doing about everything? My dad is very sick. Look, I'm the only one taking care of him. Wow, what are you planning on doing now? I don't know what to do. I'm just confused. Confused? You can't be confused at this time, AZ. What can I do? I will leave that house if it were me. What about my dad? I can't just leave him behind. So you want to keep staying in this suffering? You didn't go to school, nothing. She won't let me leave. I'm only able to come here because I said I'm going to the hospital to collect my drugs. What about your parents' money? Who is in control of it? My lawyer said it was in my name, but now I don't know about anything anymore. I know you're worried about your dad, but you have to let go of everything and leave that house. If I leave him behind, he will die because these two don't care about him anymore. I was with Marcos last night. I acted like you wouldn't go to see him. How was it? He shut down the whole restaurant for us, Zoe. Can you believe that? Wow, looks like you got a very rich man. I'm happy for you. Well, I haven't said yes to him yet. Who's keeping you? Do you want him to go for another? Nothing. Still thinking about it. There's nothing to think about. You should jump at it the way it comes. You and rich guys, why not find one and forget about the broke Jordan? Give me Marcus then. No, I'm not. And you stay away from my man. I'm not coming for him. Let's say I agree to leave. You will like Koalima. Where are you going to stay? It's not what matters. Have you made up your mind? Can you away from home? Yes. Is that a home? Easy. This is no longer a home but a prison. All I wanted was a happy home, Halima. Life is never fair to anyone. This is your own chair. <sighs> Look, it's not about crying. You have to do something or not. You will keep wasting time. I'm angry at a lot of things, Salima. I'm angry at my dad. He should have not brought all this into my life. I'm not in your shoes, but I sure do understand how you feel right now. A part of me wants to leave home, but I feel even with everything he has done, he's still my dad, right? I can't just leave him like that. I know he's your dad, and that's why he said you can't stay at home forever. I'm very sure the only regret he's having now is seeing you this way. You think so? If you have made up your mind, you can come stay with me until you get something to do for yourself. Thank you so much. You are the only help I have found for myself in a very long time. That is why we are here for each other, Uzi. 
Please take a seat, Jordan. Thank you, ma. The last time we spoke, you told me about how your woman never respects you. I think that women never respect a man who has less money than them. That's all. Have you now spoken to her about it? I think that's who Zoe is, and I just have to accept her that way. Why haven't you applied to other places that will pay you more than this? No one will want to employ a convict. I'm surprised you gave me the job when I first applied. If I didn't give you the job, it means I'm sending you out there to go and commit another crime. Thank you so much, ma, because I don't know what I would have done without you. It's okay. I called you today to know your story. Maybe I can help out. This is my story, ma. I'm a man trying all I can do to make my life better and also provide for the woman man i love why haven't you left her all this time i'm very sure there's someone out there who appreciates this little i'm big at loving and zoe can be annoying but she was there for me when i had no one she gave in her all i see so i want to give her the best not to lie she deserves it and that's why most times i can only get angry at her but living will feel like i betrayed her what if she's the one who leaves you what are you going to do then i will beg until i make her come back and if i can't then i'll just accept that's what she wanted good you're a good man anyway the the reason I called you here is twofold. The first is you have been promoted to the head of sales here. Oh my god, thank you ma. Don't thank me. The money you are making here is little. But I will speak to someone who has some programs for ex-convicts to help them back into society. I would really appreciate it if you did this for me. Marcos, what are you doing here? I thought I would take you out for lunch. I hope I can tag along. I'm not busy. Yes, you can. But it will only happen if Lucy accepts. No, she's not going. I'll bring lunch for her here. I can't just show up whenever you like. You don't like the fact that I'm here to check on my woman. Keep it low. I'm not your woman. I haven't even accepted any relationship in the first place. To me, you're already mine. I don't know why you won't say yes to me. I'm not lying to you, Marcus. I'm very busy. I can't go out for lunch. Then I'll ask them to bring it over and we can eat together here. All you're doing is finding a way to spend more time with me. I'm crazy about you. I don't even know how to hide it. If I say yes to you, what are you going to give me? Name your price. I'll pay. I'm not asking you to pay me. Where are you coming from? I went to the hospital to get that medication. Liar. I'm not lying, ma. I'm telling the truth. Didn't I tell you not to leave this out? I'm sorry, ma. Forgetting his drugs was important. Him taking the drug changes nothing in him. You are just wasting money. I'm very sure he will get better someday. You will keep taking care of him until he gets better. Then it's not like I care. I will soon be out of here anyway. I hope that happens, ma. I don't need your prayer. Go to the kitchen and get me something to eat. Okay, ma. I know you are going to give him his drug. Make sure you wash your hand well before you prepare my food. I don't want to be infected. Yes, ma. Look at her because I told her I'm leaving. She's happy. I'm leaving with everything. I might just leave this house for her and her father. It was her convincing that lawyer boy he agrees with me. I know things would fall into place soon for me and Nora. Even with everything, she still has some pride, just like her mother. It will shock you when you realize there's nothing left. But in the meantime, I'm going to frustrate her life. She will wish to die. Lucy, it's hard to see you these days. She's the busiest among us. What do you expect from her? I'm sorry I've been busy. Um, there's this new guy I met. He hasn't been giving me space. Do you even love that guy? You don't seem to have any time. My love is important. Just be careful and don't repeat what happened in school. Never will I fall victim to that again, but this particular guy is very rich and knows how to spoil a woman. Have you been to his house or seen his account? He shut down a whole restaurant for me and paid right in front of me. Wow, why is Lucy the only one meeting all those richness? I'm leaving tomorrow. I don't know why you are deciding to leave. There are a lot of things you can do here for yourself. I know, and I want to go out there. I feel there's a lot I can do, such as finding my purpose and helping out young folks out there. We are going to miss you, but I wish you the best. We are going to talk always, and you two should look out for each other. No fight. Thank you for finally agreeing to meet me. What you're asking me to do is a crime, and I could go to prison for it. If this is something between us, there is no way you can go to prison, Mr. Lawyer. How could I be sure that you will meet the end of the agreement? I'm a woman of my word, and why won't I meet the end of the agreement? I know what desperate people like you do. I'm glad you know what people like me can do. But as you can see, I did not go through with it. What about Azal? She could file a case against me. Don't worry. 
worry about Azel. She will be taken care of and main friends will come close to you. When you say taken care of, are you planning on committing murder? God forbid. I plan on making arrangements with her to live on the US while I get a nanny that will look after her father. I see. You have everything planned out. What is my portion? I'm giving you 70-30. No, I want 60-40. The risk I am taking is high and I might lose my certificate if everything does not go as planned or if it discovers in the end. No one will know. Look, you gave him too fast. Just do this for me and you will work out a very rich man. I have to go now. I will contact you when the documents are ready for you to sign and you have to find a way to make a sign. For how long do I have to stay alone suffering like I'm a nobody? These two came into my house and destroyed it. They are the example of the father that says the devil comes to steal, kill, and destroy. Your dad already left you. AZ. You just have to stop enjoying all this nonsense your dad, mistress, and her daughter are doing to you. Halima is not lying. I have to do something about my life. These people have destroyed everything for me. I can't just sit and watch them anymore how will i do this so that they won't know that i'm leaving i have to be very careful if not they will lock me in the house like they did the last time how come the thought of running away never runs through my mind i'm here agreeing to stay all this time i should leave that way she won't be able to lay her hands on anything that's mine let's see how she'll be able to steal my money while i'm out of here and she can't wish me or know where i am staying Baby, you have not touched your food. Why? Why would you bring me to this kind of place, Jordan? It's beautiful here. We can talk and have fun. You call this noisy place a place to have fun? Zoe, you said you wanted me to take you out. I did. Why are you now complaining? This place is not up to my standard. We also came here together. Why are you not seeing an issue with it? Jordan, you need to do more. Guys out there are shutting down places for their babe. Are you here doing what I don't know? You're asking me to do something I can't afford. Do what your mates out there are doing. Like money sacrifice, stealing, or making be using you to make money you surely can't use me to make money jordan i won't even do something like that in the first place look i don't like it here i want somewhere very classy and romantic why are you always doing this to me? i'm living here i don't know how i ended up with someone like you in the first place baby please let's just enjoy this i promise i will save to take you out another time your whole salary for a year can't afford the kind of dinner or date i want and i'm not using my money to take you out on a date zoe you are causing a scene no reason you should let me leave otherwise i might get louder than this. What can I do that will be right at her side? She said she wanted to go out. I took her out and she's here complaining. This is not what she wants. Do I have to kill myself for her? How does she expect that I shut down the whole place for her? Who would like her that kind of money to do so? She didn't even eat what I ordered. I just wasted my money. She left. How does she expect me to get home now? Tell me. I got some good news. You finally got the money. Not yet. But now we have the lawyer on our side and he has agreed to work with us. Wow, that's good news. We don't need her though anymore. Yes, we don't need her. But we have to be very careful that she doesn't know what we are up to. If she knows about it, there's nothing she can do. True. And we will lock her in until we are done with the deal. And then we will leave the country. Spending money the way we like. See, I told you it will all end in joy in the hand yes you did all i just wish is i spent more time with dad you are still thinking about a man who did not make plans for your future i'm not thinking about him anymore i'm only wishing what happened did not Now I'm walking home because I used the money I had to take her out. She refused to eat what I got for her. Got angry and left. She should have considered I would need to get home. What does this person want now? Can't he or she see I'm trying my best to walk these miles back home? Jordan. Madam BC. I saw the body structure from afar. I told myself that it was you and now I'm correct. Oh yes ma, it's me. What are you doing here? This is the road where vehicles can use. I should be asking you what you are doing here and why you are trekking. I live around here ma. This is a highway. How can you be living around here Jordan? I'm not committing any crime. I'm just taking a walk back home. A walk back home? Do you know how many miles it is to the city? It's exercise ma. One needs it sometimes to keep the body and soul fit. Enough of the talking. Get into the car. Let's find some way to talk and eat. I'm hungry. I should enter your car. Like your car? Yes, Jordan. I'm not supposed to park here. 